In the early 1900s, the world was confronted with a shortage of rubber, and the difficulties associated with filling tires with air during the First World War further intensified the need for alternative solutions. In response to this situation, German engineers devised a groundbreaking invention in 1916, the steel spring tire. The primary objective behind the creation of the steel spring tire was to address the scarcity of rubber and the unreliability of conventional rubber tires. The engineers aimed to develop a tire that not only provided a viable alternative to rubber but also offered enhanced reliability, particularly for military vehicles that required robust and durable tire solutions. The innovative steel spring tire made its first appearance on a Protos vehicle, serving as a testament to its potential for military applications. Instead of the traditional rubber construction, the tire's design incorporated a series of steel springs arranged in a circular pattern. These strategically placed springs provided both support and flexibility, enabling the tire to withstand the rigorous demands of military operations while offering improved traction on various terrains. One of the key advantages of the steel spring tire was its resistance to punctures and damage, significantly reducing the need for constant maintenance and tire replacements. This attribute made it particularly attractive for military vehicles operating in challenging environments, such as battlefields or rough terrain. Furthermore, the German engineers believed that the steel spring tire's performance would remain unaffected by adverse weather conditions, which was a common issue with traditional rubber tires. The unique design of the tire was expected to maintain its reliability and functionality even in extreme temperatures, making it well suited for military campaigns in diverse climates. While the steel spring tire initially gained attention due to its potential military applications, there was also significant interest in its civilian use. The tire's durability and puncture resistance made it an attractive option for commercial vehicles, especially those that frequently traveled on rough roads or encountered sharp debris. However, despite showing promise, the end of the First World War and subsequent advancements in rubber technology led to a shift back towards traditional rubber tires. Rubber became more accessible again, and improvements in tire manufacturing techniques and materials enhanced the reliability and performance of rubber tires. Consequently, the steel spring tire gradually faded from use, becoming a fascinating but short-lived chapter in the evolution of tire technology. Nonetheless, the ingenuity of the German engineers in developing the steel spring tire during a time of resource scarcity and technological challenges remains a testament to human innovation and adaptability in the face of adversity. Their tire design showcased an alternative approach to overcome limitations and paved the way for future advancements in tire technology.